Hi folks, today we're down in Cresco, Iowa, working on a um, log home that was built 35 years ago by a company called uh, Pacific Log Homes, I think what uh, the name of the company was, but anyway, it's really uh, held up um, quite well. It's got some pretty generous overhangs on it, but there still are some... Uh, spots where it's uh, got some deterioration and it's mainly because there uh, is a 360 degree deck around the building and with no gutters on the house there's a certain amount of splashback that we call it that occurs when the rain hits the deck and we're gonna, I'm going to show you what uh, we're up against around the corner here. One of the guys is cutting off the bottom. Of the tree. The owner's already removed a portion of this log and done some epoxy work on it. And we got a little more to do right here. So, um... There's, a, there's an area over here where uh, some extra work has popped up in these little spaces. Um, well, I suppose I should leave that one way or the other. Um, we got to fill those with epoxy and possibly cover them with a chunk of bevel lap siding um, to tuck it up here and just cover the whole area. Over here. Um, the owner has removed another um, one of the bottom half logs, and we're gonna we're gonna trim it back and, and make it look a little nicer. And then uh, the bottom of this log is in pretty good shape, and this one's in good shape too. So um, those are the easy fixes. Over here is where things get more. Interesting. We got we got some <coughs> decay here. Uh, now we're gonna have to cut the face off of this and replace most of it. Um, and then over here, right, things get really interesting. The half log here is really bad shape, so we're going to be taking off as much of that's necessary. Um, probably down past that outlet, but anyway, we're gonna we've got some logs that we brought along to to do that with. The only trouble is they're basically natural logs and these are all turned logs with a nice uniform um, surface so uh, I'm gonna go sharpen up my curve base planer and uh, attempt to turn those logs into something that looks more like these um, so we'll check it out at the end of the job and you'll We'll see how well I did. Thanks for watching, folks.